Alleluia, alleluia. Alleluia, alleluia. I am the way, the truth, and the life, says the Lord. No one comes to the Father except through me. Alleluia, alleluia. 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 The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory to you, O Lord. Herod the Tetrarch heard about all that was happening, and he was greatly perplexed because some were saying that John has been raised from the dead. Others were saying Elijah has appeared. Still others, one of the ancient prophets has arisen. But Herod said, John, I beheaded. Who then is this about whom I hear such things? And he kept trying to see him. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. It's a very interesting uh, uh, account of uh, um, Herod the Tetrarch, who was the really the the uh, Jewish political leader of the day, uh, and uh, he. Uh, even in the midst of his, and I would call it a secular world, uh, was hearing uh, of all the things that Jesus uh, was doing and saying, both. And he was drawn to him uh, as he was drawn to John the Baptist. Uh, and uh, it's really quite a, quite a moment um, a reflection really for all of us that uh, that the things that are happening in our lives and that uh, the things we hear from uh, Jesus himself are what draws us to him in the end it is his love which is abounding in miracles it is love abounding in his word and his love abounding even in this especially in this Eucharist where his body and blood are present to us um, that tugging on Herod's heart is the same tugging on our hearts uh, and it's a tugging to the truth it's a tugging to God's love and it's a tugging also to God's mercy and peace Let's pray that uh, we may, this day, all throughout the day, respond to Jesus uh, calling us to himself in love.